what's going on guys welcome back to some xenoverse 2 so it's brought to my attention that there is a new dragon ball game in the making it's like dragon ball fighters or something that's like the name it's given so far and there um, there is going to be a link in the description of the entire article itself so hopefully you guys just read that and see what all the hype is about because it seems to be like in the two screenshots that are under the article in the link it seems to be the fact that this fighter isn't going to be like xenoverse or tenkaichi or any of it it's going to be like more like budokai like how it how it was like on the ps2 and stuff which is quite nice to see because personally i really like that style but it's quite interesting i think i i don't know what uh thing people who are making it the developers i don't know who they are I, I don't recall like what they're like they're about but seeing these screenshots like how like they seem pretty high res even though like the quality is pretty pretty crap on it to be honest quite interesting to see like this new Dragon Ball game coming out and I honestly I can't wait because it's been a long time since I played like a 2D fighter Especially a Dragon Ball 2D fighter on top of that. Like, the last time I played it was on, like, the PS2 days, which was, like, ages ago. And it, it's nice to see that that type of style is coming back. To an extent, of course. But I'm sort of hyped for it. But I want to see more about it. I want to learn more about this, but this game before I get, like, all, <laughs> like... I just jump on the hype train, like, that's not my style. Even though I do get hyped, let's be honest. But, I really want to see more about this game before anything else. Because this game could be a gem, it could be another crappy game, who knows. But, I honestly do understand the hype behind it, because it's been a long time since we got a duty fighter like that. Hopefully they do it like Budokai 3 style, except for the little hyper mode thing, which I thought was dumb. But hopefully this game is a strong game, that it could it could uh, hold a audience of some kind. It might even be a competitive fighter, let's be honest. Because looking at like Tekken or Smash Bros or uh, what else, Injustice 2 or something. I personally, I wouldn't mind if this was a competitive fighter. Like, personally, I've been uh, really wanting a 2D fighter or like some type of fighter to play. Yes, there is Storm 4, and it's dead, let's be honest, it's been dead. But, hopefully you guys do read the article that is in the description. I'm gonna make sure I put that in, like, I'm gonna try my absolute hardest to make sure. That, that's there but honestly I, I want to see more screenshots I want to see more everything about the game let's be honest but it's quite interesting to see this develop thing developers I keep messing up on that but hopefully they do a really good job on it like I see a lot of potential here and like, Xenoverse and Xenoverse 2, yeah, they can be competitive fighters, but people don't really play them as a competitive fighting game. It's more like, it's more casual, I like to say. It's not like, uh, I have to be the very best like no one ever was. <laughs> but that's Pokemon. <laughs> but even though there are those people who really want to be good at these games, like, don't get me wrong. Like, I'm not trying to take away anything from them, but I still feel like 2D fighters always have a longer lifespan than 3D fighters. Because looking at, like, Storm 4, it, like, died in, like, the first uh, four months, I would like to say. While other games like Smash Bros on, like, the GameCube or N64 have been alive for so long. And like people still play them and stuff. It's quite interesting to see if that same effect happens to this fighter 
I want to say it's a f well technically it is going to be a fighter but I really want to see what this develop developers like what what they can do with something like Dragon Ball like something people really respect and hold to a high high standard I know there's not a lot of people who hold Dragon Ball to a high standard but personally I hold it to a very high standard but only time will tell and give us the real answers that we want but let me know if you guys are hyped about this new Dragon Ball game that's coming out a 2D fighter instead of a 3D game and it's quite interesting to see the fact that they're going back to that old uh, formula that they used to have but other than that guys the article is in the description let me know in the comment comments Jesus Christ can I talk for two seconds uh, let me know down in the comments if uh, you guys think this is a good thing or a bad thing that they're going back to the or old formula or not if you're hyped or not so other than that guys thank you guys for watching this video so much and I hope to see you guys in the next one later